Hello, you're here with Chrissy Betts and welcome. Basically, what we're going to be doing today is another episode of Battlefield 4 and the gameplay, see how it is online, you know, how it is. And I'm going to try snipe again. Not going to say I'm any good at this game because it's been a while since I've been on. So, I guess all I'm going to have to do is spawn on spawn. So, um,. Gotta get my bearings ready. Uh, figure out where we're going. So uh, I hope you I hope you can. Ah, oh, damn. Okay, I guess you guys saw that before I did. So unfortunately, I ten uh, tended to die. So that's what that what happens, you know, when bullets fall straight in front of you. So uh, so right, I spawn on another guy. No one else at the hill. Cool. Right, boom. So for those of you who have not played Conquest before, or Battlefield uh, 4, it is an amazing game. Really is. I just got reintroduced back into it. I know it's quite an old game. Just got reintroduced back into it not too long ago by my old friend Lawrence, and he was saying, uh, you've got to get yourself back on the game. And I was like, oh man, but I'm playing Hitman. You know, all the new games that are coming out. and..." Damn, I shouldn't have waited a day before I decided to go play on play on with him. It was a really, I just forgot how good it was. It really was. And for those of you who play Battlefield, you understand how good it is. And how frustrating it can be. You know, you can run around, you can have really good games, you can get 40 odd kills. And, you know, very few deaths. And it, it's not about your kill to death on this game. You know, it it is a game that... It is purely on how good you are, and you know you're shooting. And for those of you who, you know, played the game before, you understand the bullet drop system, especially with sniping, and the you know short range weapons won't go as far, which is which is really good, really awesome. Loved it, and uh, damn, ah oh, mate. At that range, your bullet should have dropped straight away. You know what I mean? No, never mind. Yeah, there, there's my bed. I haven't got my headphones on fully, so I can't really hear if anyone's around any corners or anything. So it's purely on my reactions, which at the moment are quite terrible. I do need to get back into the, uh, you know, the, the way things really work on this game. Uh, got a nice headshot there. Don't stand still, Ginger. Don't stand still. Right. Nice little uh, crouch. Let's see if we can get in there. Damn, where's he going? Where's he going? Is he going up? Is he going down? What? Alright, so... So this game is, you know, you got to shoot in front of them. Quite far. Oh, damn. I'm doing terribly. Please excuse my awful shooting. Not great. Do have friends that are much better than me on this game, but uh, you know, in the future, hopefully, if you guys would, you know, like and subscribe, hopefully we can get these guys together, make a good group. I do have a friend that is bloody awesome at sniping. You know, he he's one of those that, if you were playing Call of Duty, he was one of those people that you hated. Quick scoping. He just has natural talent for games like this. And, uh, you know, unfortunately he's not on tonight. I'm sensing a bit of glitching around here while I'm running. Don't know if you guys can see that or not. But, um, yeah, it's... If you can get a group of people on this, it'll be so fun. It's really good to work as a team. But at the same time, almost impossible. And I am getting shot at, and I'm not really paying much attention. So, right, here we go, here we go. Excuse the language. What the hell? Right, those guys are my next target. I'm gonna go around for them. Don't care how long it takes me for to get to them. I need to get him. So I'm gonna go for him. Um effects very close. What? Okay. Mr. Fireman, I hope you can go save a cat out of a tree because I tell you what, shoot me in the back like that as a spawn, not not funny. There's a helicopter I could jump out of, but uh, 
best idea? Probably not. Uh, th there are some uh, enemies around, as far as I saw on the map. It's a matter of keeping, keeping low key, really. Come on, what's going on? Alright, bullet drop, bullet drop, follow the bullet. Terrible. Okay. As I don't know whether you guys can see, but there is actually quite a bit of lag in this game. Uh, which isn't helping helping my sniping situation. Where did that where, where did that guy go? I'm just, right, I'm go I'm running away. I don't think I could win. What? Honestly, I hope you guys are seeing this because uh, quite quite a bit of lag in this, so it's not <laughs> not as fun as and, and definitely not what I'm used to. To be honest, I uh, don't really know. Don't know whether it's a server or not, or whether we're having some technical issues. Um, but it's been a long time since I've seen it. Be quite this bad to be honest so as you can see enemies there bit of bullet drop terrible shot but it, it's just getting used to you know all these these angles the distance between when you're shooting them so don't know how that hit him really because I did shoot in front of him so do think there is a fair bit of lag in this game but anyway like I was saying earlier on awesome game absolutely fantastic um, you know re really there isn't much out there that can compete with this Call of Duty is nice close range like I said in my last last episode there were certain things I didn't enjoy about Call of Duty not saying I hate it but there were certain things that made me not want to play it again you know taking it far too futuristic just seem, you know, I don't know about you guys, whether it's just me or not, but, you know, in, I really enjoy the old-fashioned sort of things. You know, and you've got your old carbine, and, you know, it was, it was awesome to get that sniper's kill, you know, when you actually hit someone, you felt awesome. The old-fashioned style, you know, you go around killing people. World at War was a good one. A lot of gore. And a lot, uh, a lot of this with this game is predicting where people are going to go, so do excuse a lot of the random firing around people, but it, it, you can imagine it's such a long distance, and it's just trying to see where they're, where they're going to run to, you've got to predict that, and you know, that's what makes this game awesome. Shall I go for this game? Shall I go for him? Shall I try knife him? <laughs> okay, yeah, so Mr. Fireman got me again. So this is another good thing about this game. You know, he's obviously got his headphones on and he can see, he can, not see, he can hear someone coming up behind him. You know, I should have crept up a li little bit quieter and I could have been a little bit more stealthy about that. But it's a reaction time on when you knife, you know. I press a knife now. And there's a, there's a good like second and a bit delay. So when you run past someone and you haven't hit it at the ex the exact time, it can't. Oh, bad, bad move. A bit of a, a bit of a silly little moment there. Yeah. But it, it can lead to um you know a small bit of a small few bugs in the game where you know the the catching up of the knifing. Like Call of Duty, you run up to someone, you knife them. Um, all fair dues and you hit them in the back which is fantastic but this game's very automated uh, with some good animations and absolutely so good when you actually do get that knife kill you know it's, it's one of those that when you're in a squad once you get the knife kill and your mates see you up there on that board with the knife kill they're all like oh yeah how fantastic good for you you know how amazing you're so good at this game amazing little man but really, yeah, no, they never say that. But um, it's, it's such an achievement. And the same with sniping. It's like, you can see I've not really had many kills for a while. Because I'm not 
not really in the action, but game is a little bit laggy at the moment. Like I said, I don't know with the server or whether I'm having personal technical issues with my network, so we'll have to see how it really goes. So I'm gonna try capture this flag and hope that no one goes for it. P please excuse the yeah, accent changing, it's uh, part of who I am. I don't really know what my real voice sounds like. So, so number D, 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 D for uh, Devereaux, yeah, that, that's it, D, D for Devereaux, uh, D for Daddy, you know, those sort of things. That's where I'm going, right, where's my next one? Shall I go for E? Is that me getting shot out of the a teammate shooting past me? Right, enemy spotted. Thank you, darling. Damn, what, what happened there? Shit, I'm shooting. God, that crouching system is ridiculous. Right, I'm gonna have to go back and try. Cre Damn. Who is that? I'm being double teamed here. Don't know whether they spot me or whatever. Or ah, my my team was sorted them out. Right, on that tail. Thank you, Dying. Nice little kill there. Close rank. Pull me pissy out. Tango down. There you go. How does that feel? Probably not so great, Mr. Fireman. So there you go, sir. Apologies for those who uh, don't understand what I just did there. Yeah. Very personal. It's killed me quite a few times, so I had to, I had to do that. So, uh, as you can see, it's such a massive map. Massive maps all over, you know, the different gameplay sort of bring out different different game styles, the way you should play, the way you can play, you know, a sniping goes, I try to snipe in every map I can, stupid even try and play on team death matches where the maps are completely, completely different, they're so much smaller, you know, they are the same maps but uh, they are just sort of shrunken down and I don't know if you noticed earlier on, when you hit the borders, it starts counting down from 10, so, you know, you, you can't really do a great deal. If you st stay out in that zone, you do die. So, uh, try and avoid that. Or at least, if you're going to make a good run for it, make sure there's a good lot of their team around behind the wall. I'm really good. What are you shooting at? What are you shooting at, honestly? So close range, I'm not so great. And probably at long range, I'm not so great, but whatever. So there's my spawn point from before, which is very close to the mountain, which I will say now is a hot spot for snipers. So, you know, I could, I could probably, I'm going to say it a bit too early and no one's going to be here, but I would say, oh. I would say this is a hot spot for snipers and I was just about to say I bet if I say that now too early that it isn't gonna happen where you don't see them uh, yeah yeah that's a good example you know there's loads of people on this particular mountain on the map I don't know whether you can see it on my poor screen or whatever I do god it's been so long I don't really know how to get on my map but anyway yes can sort of see it it's the biggest mountain in this map anyway as, as far as I'm concerned with you know the popularity of it for snipers and stuff it's it's awesome had many a good time on this mountain myself I'm never gonna hit that guy you know I could fire one shot off and there's no chance I'm gonna hit him because he's moving far too much all I can do is tag him, you know, hope someone nearby is going to get him. There's quite a few people over there. My dip's a bit far. Enemy machine gun is spotted east of your location. Damn! Come on, man. Alright. Well, he's going there, he's hiding away. Quite calm.